Good morning, everyone. Uh, thought I would attempt to vlog my life today. It's gonna be a weird one, guys. It's gonna be a weird one. So, just woke up, got ready, and like, well, I'm not ready. I'm not ready at all, actually. I pretty much just got out of bed and got dressed, but uh, I have to head to the Style Hall offices because they're giving me an amazing present because they love me so much, so. Let's go get it. I'll, I'll tell you guys in the car. I'll tell you what it is. Don't give me that cute face, girly. Don't do that. Don't do that. She's, she, cause she wants the fancy food, which I give them every night as a special treat, but she needs to eat the, the dry food, honey. The dry food. And do my dishes while I'm gone. Make use of yourself, yeah? Baby, this is tragic. Cause we had it. We was magic. I was flying. Desperate times, desperate, <laughs> desperate times go over desperate measures, guys. Gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, so here's what's happening. Style Hall is uh, awesome. Well, I've been with Style Hall for many, many, many years. Five, four, four years, five years, something like that. Four years. Um. Every now and then they like to do really awesome things for their partners, creators. And so they just text me, they're like, hey, you wanna go see Sam Smith? I'm like, fuck yeah, I wanna go see Sam Smith. So they're giving me tickets. So I'm going to pick them up. Um, where is their building? I think I'm almost there. Anyway, uh, okay, so here's something kind of crazy. They're giving me two tickets. And I'm like, who do I bring? Or thought, Evelina, she's out of town. Literally asked like every single one of my other friends. They either have something going on, or they're like not that into Sam Smith. They don't want to go. So I'm like, all right, is this? Damn, you see, it's so loud. Uh, is this the world telling me that I should ask a date? Like, is it time? Is it time? <laughs> It's probably not time, but you know what? I like pushing myself to do things that scare me or that I feel internally that I shouldn't do. I, I think it's good for you. So I'm going on a date tonight, you guys. I'm bringing a date and as much as it probably won't be appropriate to vlog, I thought, it's gonna get interesting, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna vlog. I mean, I think it will just leave a lasting impression if I vlog. <laughs> He'll be like, oh hell no with this girl, oh hell no. But I probably won't vlog him just because I don't wanna scar him for life. I know you guys would not be nice. So, um, you know, yeah. Wait, is this it? Oh shit, this is it, I think. Okay, yes, this is it, wait, no. Wait, all right, I gotta go. <laughs> I've made it. We're having some little snacks. Layla, she's my main girl here at Style Hall, my hookup. <laughs> <laughs> Looking out, baby. She gave me my tickets. I'm so excited. I told her I wanted to bring her, but she said she refused to let me. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I told them, I was like, I couldn't find anyone to go with me, so it was the universe telling me I had to bring a date. Right. Like, I had to. I had to. <laughs> I just had the most awkward interaction. This guy. Hi, <laughs> Don't say his name! What if he watches this? I don't think he knew you were. Well, I don't know. He he came, he asked me about being vegan and then asked me about the banana diet and I mentioned Freely. And he's like, oh my god, you know Freely? And I was like, yeah. And then we parted and then he came back over here and asked. <laughs> Asked you out. I, you <laughs> I should have brought him. That was the universe telling me to bring him. No, absolutely. Not. And then he's like, I'm like, um, you know, like I'm not available. He's like, yeah, I have a goldfish. <laughs> Legit. Look at this sick view. My view is pretty good at my place, but. Mm, probably not this good. <laughs> probably not this good. <laughs> Everyone working hard over there. Working real hard. 
Grill and probably just gonna say fuck it and still go to the beach. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know. I'm feeling nervous about tonight. I just like, I can't, I have to stay busy because I'll just, you know, I have to stay busy and probably have a few drinks. Oh, yeah, David's here. Yeah, oh, David's here. Yeah. We just had a, a lunch with some deep talks. And then I, we walked past a wax center. I was thinking about getting my vagina wax, but <laughs> <laughs> I love how it just says walk in, strut Shut out. You're just feeling so good about being hairless. <laughs> more scary than this an abandoned bus like I can guarantee you people are living in this is terrifying oh my god <laughs> so we are in Venice going to the beach and this is actually really crazy for me because this is where I lived when I first moved to California like five years ago four and a half four and a half -ish. Old memories. oh my god and we're about to walk past my house where I lived with my girl Andrea. Oh my gosh. The feels, guys, the feels. <laughs> All right, not this one, but this next one right here. Here it is, that was my window. I used that window to film. Crazy, right? That is Crazy. So cool. Crazy. Yes, if you guys, if you guys wanna come take pictures in front of it, you know. <laughs> Oh my god, the memories. I used to walk this way probably like three or four times a week. Go to the beach, get like some snacks. Whatever you give me would mean the well. If you give me a 10, I'll go home feeling like a superstar. If you give me a 20, I'll go home with you. Hey! <laughs> All right, in my swimsuit, gonna soak up some sun, maybe take a few pictures. And the timing, this bird's laughing at me, shit. <laughs> anyway, I'm literally just like in a swimsuit and socks, socks and shoes and a jacket right now, like just styling, like show them. <laughs> Guys, this is like perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like my butt. Your butt. <laughs> How do you even do this now? <laughs> It's just too cold. We got in the water for like three seconds. They're like, no. Nah. It was warm. It was not yes, warm. Yes, it was. You're crazy. You're like a it vampire or something. Cause <laughs> that shit was not warm. My hair looks so fucking dirty. You look like a model. Yeah, yeah. All the sea salt, well, like all let the all me the. Take your pictures. <laughs> well, <I'm lying. laughs> wow, this is a really scary freaking plant, man. Doesn't it look like an octopus. It does look like an octopus. It's like, Making that other plan, it's bitch. <laughs> Alright, about to try to make the impossible turn. We might die. Just brace yourselves. Go for it. Oh, we're good. Just kidding. Minus this one guy. Hey. Hey, yeah, I need to be in there. Let me in there, yo. Uh, so it's turned into like a super shitty rainy day. Wait, is this it? I'm so confused right now. I know. 
I was so, I was like, what? Is she talking to me right now? Wait, no. Where? It's recording. What? No, I know. I'm confused about driving. Where's the ramp? This is like right here. It's right here. Do I, I go in there? I believe so, yeah. That's so weird. Anyway, yeah, yeah it. it's raining cats and dogs. Good thing we got the pictures done just in time. Yeah, really, though? We could have done some sexy rain shots. <gasps> That's right. No, my hair is like the grossest I've ever seen it in my entire life. I was like gonna shower, but then I was like, we'll have to shower when I get home, so what is the damn point, you know? I'm getting nervous. <laughs> I'm getting oh, nervous. Girl, take off your clothes, it's getting too hot. Okay, just about done getting ready. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. Need to do my hair still, obviously. Um, ew, I just feel weird. I'm feeling excited though, although I definitely still need wine. Like I need wine like right now, like I should really go open it. Wookie, Wookie, what do you think? Is it gonna be okay? Am I gonna make it through the night? Am I gonna survive? Am I gonna be awkward the whole time? Yeah, probably, okay. Yeah. We're here. I'm getting pretty excited. My heart rate is increasing. I'm ready. My body's ready. My mind's ready. Okay. Bathroom update number one. Things are going good. Going good. A little weird. <laughs> but it's good. I'm really excited to see the show. And I've had two glasses of wine, so I'm feeling relaxed, which is excellent. <sighs> Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to say that I think that Sam Smith is one of the most genuine artists right now. The smile on his face is so real, it warms my heart, and the entire concert I just felt so happy. <laughs> and I think he's brilliant, and I think he sounds even better live than he does on his CD, which is saying a lot. And <laughs> that's, that's my review for the evening. Keith? Oh, are you sad that you didn't get to go see Sam Smith tonight? You would have liked him. He was really good. Well, guys, um, first of all, the show was amazing. I know I gave my review already, but <laughs> it uh, really blew me away. He is just so good. Um, anyway, so the date what I'm sure you guys would rather hear me talk about. Um, it's really weird because, uh, I don't really know how much I wanna say here. Um, so when this guy first asked me out, I honestly was gonna say no because I don't think I'm ready to date, I mean, I don't know, something in me, I mean, I talked about this earlier today, something in me was just like, I should do it, you know? Like, I should just do it. And, <laughs> but, 
But I was actually really pleasantly surprised because he's not who I was originally kind of thinking he was. And I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because at first I was like, you know what, this will just be good for me to like get out and have like a refreshing experience with someone new and you know, just kind of get back into the scene of dating people. I wasn't expecting to um, find myself having strong feelings for him or anything, but I feel like I really like him. I feel like maybe we'll have a few more dates, probably. And I don't know, I still wanna stay single though. I still wanna stay single for the year as I originally told myself I would. Uh, but you know, dating, dating is fine as long as it's not a commitment, as long as I'm still, uh, you know, having a good 95% of my time to myself to focus on myself and my goals and stuff. Because I feel like once you get into like a really deep relationship with someone, it pretty much sucks up like a lot of your time. And I really need that time to myself to grow as an individual, so. But I think casual dating is still fine. And yeah. <laughs> okay, but I'm going to go scrub my face off and go to bed. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed spending the day with me. And I don't know how often I'm gonna vlog. I really only wanna vlog when like I feel like something kind of more exciting is happening in my life. So probably not very often. Uh, but I will see you guys really soon.